freshly graduated but struggling to find work. Jiang Jialiang specialized in maritime transport, but months after graduation, he's still jobless. I applied for more than 70 jobs, but I was only called back two or three times for interviews. A large shipping company scouted him even before graduation. Now that offer has been suspended until further notice, as the once booming sector suffers from zero COVID policies. I always thought that my career was set. But this year, because of the pandemic, there are too many uncertainties. Right now, I don't know what the future will bring. Zhang isn't alone. Almost 20 percent of under 24-year-olds can't find work in China, the highest rate since Beijing started counting. This despite President Xi Jinping's words of encouragement. China's youth today are living in an extraordinary time. They have an unprecedentedly broad stage to display their full talents and incredibly bright prospects of realizing their dreams. Some young people no longer believe in these perspectives and are rejecting a life dedicated to productivity and results. A viral term for this is tangping or lying flat. On social media, enthusiasts share their experiences. It's been four months that I've been lying flat, and you? How long have you been unemployed? I feel like I've been abandoned by the world, so I'm lying flat every day. Due to the sluggish economy, some have had to change jobs. Fu Ningjie used to be in real estate. Now he's a street vendor. It's harder and harder to earn a living. Salaries aren't as high as before. Bonuses are lower. Plus, in Shanghai, the rent and the cost of living are so high. An unemployment crisis without an end in sight. According to this year's forecasts, China is expected to record its slowest economic growth in four decades.